I'm going to uh, do Puzzle Rush again. And my average is 23.59 puzzles solved, so I need to get 24 or higher to raise my average. My high is 30. Don't expect to break that. Uh, last couple, couple, yesterday I was doing some puzzle rushes, and I was only getting like 20 right. I, and then I was watching a video of uh, me doing it. It seemed to be quicker, so maybe fatigue has something to do with it, but I also try to explain as I go. Now we're going to press start. It looks like it's going to be a back rank maple group D8. There it is. And we take. Okay, looks like. Um, what's the win here? We'll just take the queen, duh. <laughs> okay, uh, well, let's see. I have a mate here. Okay, now back rank mate with starting with the check. H2 is covered by the bishop. Okay, now let's see. I have a check on B4. Uh, I have a check on. Oh, the B4, or oh, the check will, will deflect, the, let's see, we'll try to deflect the king back. Knight B4 check, king E3, then rook check. Uh, yeah, and if the king D4, I have knight C2 check, okay. I try to get these correct before I go on. I think it's, you know, I, I go for accuracy. Now there I could have won a piece, but the mate is obviously better. Now here we're going to uh, pin the queen, check, and then here pin the queen. Okay, now it smells the deflection. Uh, I think I'm just going to win the queen this way. See? Okay. Uh, now there's a check that appears to pick up the rook. And there it is. I'm double check to make sure there's no mate. It looks like queen h3 here is mate. Okay, now looks like a mate in two or three. And there it is. Okay, now let's see. Discovery wins the queen. Okay, now let's see. I have all kinds of discoveries. Uh, so probably this one to win the queen is the correct one. All right, now let's see. There's a knight takes c7. Probably more important is, is the queen check. And then I just pick up the bishop. Yep, there it is. Okay, now uh, looks like this king is vulnerable, so... Don't want to take with the queen, we'll take with the rook, and then we just win the queen. Okay, now the bishop is pinned, so I can just take the queen, right? Okay, now, um, removing the defender, looks like bishop takes e5, and then we pick this off. Okay, now, let's see, there's a fork with the knight on c5. Okay, now, there's a check on e3, win the bishop. Okay, now let's see. Oh, two twenty, two two twenty-eight left. They're going pretty quick today. So White has down a two rooks, with, uh, two my pieces for the rook. Uh, we have a, the checks. No, well, the checks no good. He just takes. He's protecting his rook. I don't see what G five check does. Sometimes I get a little slower on these. Um, oh, here we just take this knight. Duh, and we up the exchange. Okay, now let's see. Um, 92 check fails. Uh, oh, here we're going to play queen takes rook check and then pick off the queen. Okay, now let's see. Trying to find a knight fork. Uh, what about a discovery? Knight f3 check attacks the rook. Now, here it is. We're going to end up winning the bishop. Trade the rooks, and there it is. And then we get the bishop. Ta da! Okay, now, uh, it's the problem 1155. There's, I have a question about that that I'll address afterwards. So here we just go win the queen, right? So I'm off to a good start here. Oh, they got to play one more move. Okay, it looks like there's two safe squares for the queen. Uh, yeah, I can get this wrong if I pick the wrong one. Uh, C4 or C2? C2, he's running out of room. I'll try C4. Yep, got it. Okay, uh, let's see. Queen D1 check looks like the prop. Oh, that's the wrong one. Okay, well, I missed. I missed some every now and then. Okay, now got some mating, uh, mating tries here. 
Uh, I, I want to get something with knight g3 check in, but the pawn is pinned to the knight and the bishop are covering it. I can attract the queen into that fork, but that doesn't seem to I have to give up my queen to do that. I got this bishop that doesn't seem to be doing much. Uh, how about if we just go fork the uh, two pieces down there, the queen and the rook? Okay, now. Uh, mm, bishop takes. I'm running out of time. I failed. Okay, now just, I'm, I'm out of time. Okay, so I uh, raise my average. Uh, ideally, I, I wanted to score higher than 24 because if I keep scoring 24, I'll go up, but I'll only go up a little bit and I'll never make 24. You know, do the math. Okay, so let's take a look at what we didn't do here. Now, let's bring up the solution to the last puzzle. <laughs> I didn't have any time to play the move. Uh, I, I thought I was doing, going pretty quick. I got stuck on a few puzzles, but that happens. I am not a tactical genius at least a quick tactical genius. I have to stop and think sometimes. Okay, so black moves here. Now, I guess g3 probably is the move. The alternative would be save the tempo and then play king c5. Uh, okay, it is g3. And if the king goes back, we just march our king up, push the e pawn, and eventually he has to give some ground. You know, I only had a couple seconds left. I never would have played this many. Okay, so I kind of had, had the right idea, but I don't get credit for it. Now, I missed this one. Uh, <clears throat> That's what the solution is here. Try to solve it. One more attempt to solve it with, without uh, just peeking at the solution. I didn't uh, really attempt to solve the last one. I said there were basically two moves. Okay, so what to do here? Well, I didn't look at queen check. Uh, if king g7, I don't see a follow-up. What was I playing? Bishop takes f7 check? <coughs> and that didn't work. Um, oh, here it's simple. Queen b8 check and pick off the bishop. See, there it is. So I got it this time. Okay. So sometimes I miss the obvious things. But this puzzle was is a lot of fun. I'll try another uh, shot at it here in a moment. Okay, so what to do here? What did I miss here? Uh, first off, white's move is b4. Now I was playing the queen check. Oh, hey, look, I missed uh, queen a3 check. That, that seems to force it. The king only has b1, and then rook uh, d1 is mate. See, now I, now I solved. <laughs> okay, I, I had a comment about the one was 11.55. I wanted to verify something. Uh, it has to do with knight versus rook pawn in the ending. Okay, so here was a liquidation to, uh, uh, you know, give a discover check, draw the king into a knight fork, so the question here, and I can't move the pieces, unfortunately, on this, but the question is, <clears throat> can black get enough uh, play with this uh, with this a pawn? Uh, so white black is going to play uh, 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 king takes. I can't draw any arrows. Now the pawn itself is one, two, three, four, five moves from queening. White to play one, two, three, four, five. So white's going to queen first, but if we don't do something about that pawn uh, on a5, you know, you know, it will queen. So king takes, uh, we can play uh, now do we want to play knight b6 check just yet and let the king come chase the knight a little bit. Then we can play knight d4 and black can't advance the pawn because of knight c3 check and then he'll take the pawn. So knight b, okay, so king takes knight check, king b5, knight d5, king c4. Now one thing white can do is bring the knight back to e3, but then suddenly this pawn is on a4 or this pawn is getting up to a4. 
you know, uh, whereas White had the move. So there's still, you know, there's still some questions here. And I just happened to have something in front of me. There's night endings. Didn't anticipate that. Uh, let's uh, open this up. Uh, now, knife versus pawn. Now here we don't take into account the uh, two uh, rook pawns. Uh, I mean the two uh, kingside pawns that White has. Let's open up this book a little bit and then try to find things with the rook pawns. I want to quote you the. Uh, I know there's some theoretical rules. <coughs> um, well, you know some of these are based on. Uh, Knight versus pawn. They don't have the extra pawns on the board. You know, it's basically white. To, you know, if if white didn't have the pawns on on uh, on uh, f2 and g3, you know, white white can only hope for a draw, right? Unless somehow he gets lucky and it delivers a checkmate in the corner. Uh, that is certainly not forced. So you know, these these rules kind of a little different uh, here because. Uh, white needs to expedite the promotion of his pawns. So I can tell you one thing for certain. King takes, if we just shove the pawn uh, and say the king goes to, let's say, let's put the king on b5 to, to, to kind of limit this knight. White can queen first, and, but black is queening with check. And uh, the king can come up to g2 and white will still have an extra pawn that uh, that he can promote so you know there's still still a challenge here is to stop that pawn I mean I saw this when when the puzzle went by and I did make a note uh, so I want to look at that 1155 so you know white does win this okay uh, let's try it again and I need 24 to raise my average as before and I hopefully can get 25 or higher. My highest 30. I've done that a couple of times. Okay, wait for it to click over. Okay, now it looks like I'm going to be a back rank mate. Okay, we we'll try to play these early ones as quick as we can. Okay, this one's giving me a little trouble. I'll just take the queen. Duh! I'm looking at the king. <laughs> Okay, we have the back rank. Uh, we have to go this way. Okay, now with the other rook, we get captured. Now this is a free rook. Okay, now let's see. White to play. Um, we win a knight. You know, then there'd be a rookie three next. Okay, we have a maiden one. Okay, now we take this knight with check and pick off the bishop. Now let's see, where's our mate? Looks like queen e6 is mate. Okay, now we're going to take this guy and then this guy. <laughs> All right, so let's see. That was the x-ray uh, in action. The rook on c1 protected the c8 square. Now let's see. Okay. The king is caught in the center, and there's a couple of bishops on the board. Looks like this is the check. We'll do it. And there it is. Okay, now. Uh, well, it's like queen. Yeah, queen takes rook. I was doing the math and didn't think I had enough. My math is poor today. Okay, now. Okay, d7 check. Bishop takes. Knight takes, king takes, promote to a queen. That was the solution. Now let's see, where's the mate? Uh, queen g7, queen, oh, queen g6 is the mate. We're looking at queen g7, the more aggressive square. So here's the case of removing the defender again. Now the bishop is loose. Okay, I can just take the queen, but let's go for the king, huh? Now we're going to sack the queen and checkmate. Uh, now we're going to deflect the rook from protecting the queen. 
he didn't fall for it, so it means I have to come up with another move here. We just use the X-ray defense. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, hmm. How about Bishop G5? Yeah, that's the move. Now we're going to win the queen. Ah. Uh -huh. I want to look at this one afterwards. That was the 965 puzzle. Okay. Um. Looks like a mate right here. I got two minutes left. Okay, gotta try to speed things up if I can. I was just gonna take this and uncover an attack on the knight. Okay, I'm gonna pin the queen. I don't see anything better. And we want a queen for a rook. Okay, now the king looks vulnerable. Uh, let's check with the queen. The king goes to h4. And then here it is. And we check here, and then we take here. Kaboom. All right, we gave up the queen, but we have this. This is interesting. That knight on b4 protects uh, d5. It's Legault's mate, but we're going to do it differently. We're going to do it this way. Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> okay. Um, wow. Looks like queen d8 check is deadly. Now we're going to check on d4, and that does it. Kaboom. Okay, we have a bishop check. Not sure where it goes. We have a queen check here. That was the bishop. Let's do it that way, huh? Okay, I'm up to 25, meaning I'm going to raise my average. Okay, now we've got a dangerous. So just take this. Now we're going to push that. And good day, mate. Okay. So let's see. Um, hmm. Knight f5 hits, or g5 hits f7. Looks to be it. Yep, that's it. What do I do next? Oh, take down here. Duh. <laughs> okay, now let's see. Bishop check. Saves the bishop, forces him to block. Uh, I can't sack the queen with some of the similar motives. Let's see, let's try the bishop check. No, not right. Oh, well. Uh, now let's see. Rook takes, rook takes, rook takes, queen takes. I don't have a trick with this knight on f5. I have a feeling it's rook takes. I haven't worked at all. No, it wasn't it. Okay, well, I'm going to probably get seven here. Knight takes. No, that's not right either. Oh, well, I missed the last three. But I got my average up because I got 27. So, which puzzle did I say I wanted to look at again? Is it 885? Supposed to remember this and tell me. I know that's impossible. Uh, I had a question about it. I guess I can write these write these things down as I go. This is the one that has the mate. This wasn't uh, that's the mate on G8 or the smothered mate. So let's see. I just have to look at all of them. And whatever the I had a question. Whatever it is, it'll. It'll come back to me as soon as I see the position. Okay, I think this is the X-ray defense. Uh, yeah, it comes up, and now see they're with the queen and rook protect each other. But this isn't the uh, one I had a question about. Yeah, I forgot which one I was at. Let's go back. I don't know. Maybe it's not important. Uh, No, it wasn't this one. I don't remember what it was, but there was something I had a question about. And, and it's good to have questions. Uh, okay, let's try 1041. I don't remember which one it was. This was a simple mate. This wasn't it. So it's mate one. Okay, well, let's try five, six, let me try down here a little bit. I want to find this. I want to answer the question. So I had a nice streak there, and it got broken. My biggest streak is 30 in a row. There's the x-ray defense. You know, the x-ray. Okay, that wasn't it. Now, let's see. That was 527. So these puzzles earn ratings. They go, I guess, they go up and down just like a player's. <coughs> uh, 
is the one I had a question with. Now, this is a simple mate. That's just mate. Now, there was, some, there was still some potential play, like in that knight versus pawn ending. Which one was that? Okay, let's try six. Maybe this is the same one. Let's try this 641. Yeah, maybe I'll find it. Maybe I won't. Let's see. I had trouble finding this move. It took me several seconds to realize I had that square overpowered. Uh, 641, 669. Is this it? Now I'm, I'm counting on when I see the solution to remember what my question was. Let's see. Check. Now, if he moves his king, he drops his... Um, Queen Bishop. Yeah, this, this, I had no question about this. This was a simple one. 669, 706. And I'm going to give up after, once I hit it one a, a second time, and I'm going to give up looking for it. Okay, let's see. This is probably not it. Okay, so this is a main one, Queen G6. Okay, checkmate. And probably looked at 788 already. And try one more time to find the one I had a question. Yeah, I had to. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't know it. So, you know, you can get your stats. Uh, spicy Caterpillar. I wonder which, wonder which Grandmaster that is. You got 52, so let's see who it is. Uh, some, some Grandmasters are shy. They don't say who they are. United States. Uh, uh, and somebody asks, who are you? <laughs> yeah. Some people want to be quiet, don't tell who they are. Well, that's his prerogative. So, uh, Let's look at the, these uh, stats a little bit. Your personal stats, you know, my high is 30. I, I've only recently broken 30. See, I did it March 6th and March 7th. And then my high was 27 on my third attempt at this back, I think, in January. And I did, you know, I didn't break 27 for a long time. You can see all these uh, 29s and 28s are in March. Okay. <laughs> so... Uh, yeah, there it is, January 15th, I hit 27, and I hit it a number of times since. I could not break it until recently, and I match it again up here. But approximately halfway down, that's about halfway down. I don't know, maybe, yeah, it looks about half. You know, 24, I'm close to my average. I had some bad results, which dropped me down. Uh, full history, is, you can see your all your history here, what you're uh, how you're scoring and how many have failed and your longest streak. It's kind of fun when I go through this and not strike out and just time out. Okay, uh, so thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Play PostalRussetChess.com and, you know, my first video shows what I feel are the optimal way, my, my opinion is the best ways to play this. Is, you know, don't go for the high score, go for the average and try to measure because, you know, you you know, you might just have a fluke one day and whatever, you get something you can never duplicate again. You get frustrated and quit. So, you know, we, we get better by thinking, not by necessarily by playing quick. So I, I try to solve the puzzle on the board. And uh, did I, you know what? I don't think I looked at all the solutions. I don't think I looked at any of the solutions. The ones I missed. I was busy looking for... Um, I was busy looking for the uh, one I had a question about, and I forgot about these. Okay, let's extend this down a little bit. Okay, what are these ones I missed? Um, <clears throat> I'm on the uh, chess.com team for tactics approval. That's why I have all these data here. I can I can delete any problem I want. Okay, I missed this one. I was playing what Bishop B5 check. Oh, it's simply queen a4 check and win the piece. So yeah, why didn't I see that before? Duh. 
Well, you know, I'm not Magnus Carlson. Coach Bill. <laughs> okay, so when Hmm, sleepy. Okay, so I missed this one too. Okay, what was I playing? I was playing Rick Takes Bishop. That obviously isn't it. Uh, oh, you know what it is? It's Knight F5. That's what it is. Knight from H4 to F5. Because it piles up on G7, and then if Queen takes, you know, simply Rook takes is over. So I see it now. See, there it is. And kaboom, game over. Okay, well, you know, these things happen. So ideally, I would, if I was not timing myself, I would uh, likely have solved every puzzle, because I've just solved the last two. Now I have to solve the one I only had a second at. Okay, so there's a little trickier puzzle, because Oh, look, there it is. It's right there in front of me. Queen takes rook check. Uh, duh. Now, oh, this is interesting. Do we take the rook or do we take on c2 with check? It's very risky to take on, uh, on, uh, take on h1 because white has knight takes knight double check. Followed by queen takes rook on f8 mate. So it must be queen takes c2. See? And that's that we assume the puzzle. Now white gets out of check. And then black uh, can probably get away with knight takes knight. And uh, bishop takes knight. Well, check. We just take it. So uh, black is going to be a rook ahead. So anyway, thanks for watching. Try this puzzle rush. Uh, and uh, you guys take care.